you everyone, this is Angel Hope with Angel Holt Designs and today I'm going to be creating a beautiful tag using none other than amazing products from Bella Vista Marketplace and um, I'm super excited, this is the first project I am doing for them and this will lead to many, 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 many more projects. Um, this is one of their exclusive tags, this is exclusive to Bella Vista Marketplace only and um, these are hand cut out they're made of a uh, wood which gives them really good start uh, really sturdy uh, durability and everything and yes you can do just about anything you want on these tags so um, along with their exclusive tag and many of their beautiful trims and laces that they offer as well as well as some beautiful embellishments um, I'm going to create a shabby chic feel to this tag. Also, I'm going to be pulling out um, a Prima rub-on uh, that I have been hoarding because I've been trying to find the perfect uh, project to put it on, and this one is screaming. So, also, Bella Vista Marketplace will be offering Prima really, really soon. So excited for that for y'all. And... Um, Again, I want to thank everyone that um, has given me the amazing thank yous and congratulations and everything for embarking on this amazing journey. So, without further ado, I want to get started. This is a, going to be a time-lapse uh, tutorial because there's going to be several steps. And as with all of my tutorials, you'll hear a nice little bit of music as well as I'll pop in and out if there is certain commentary that I need to add or speak of. So, again, sit back, relax, and let's get started.
Okay, um, I made this bow, as you see, and I did it in several layers, and um, I know I have this piece here, but sometimes things, you have to cover up things so that other things can look better. Um, my bow is absolutely beautiful, and I don't want to take away from that. Um, because this is using the beautiful laces from Bella Vista Marketplace and uh, trims and stuff. This right here is just uh, uh, like a, a cream colored fabric, cotton fabric you can get um, at Joanne's, Michael's, or Hobby Lobby. And, uh, but these trims here, like these uh, half inch laces, uh, quarter inch laces, this stuff is in Bella Vista. And I'll link all of that in the description box down below so my intention was was to put the bow up here but I thought well if I did that it would take away from the tag itself 
So, and then I thought, well, let's put it down here. So, and I used up a zip tie. And the reason I used a zip tie, because zip tie, I'm going to have to give me some clear ones. Um, but, um, they hold things a lot better. A lot, lot, lot better and stuff. So, um, and uh, also Bella Vista has uh, pearls and all kinds of stuff that you can purchase to uh, decorate your bow. So, um, I'm just going to have to glue over this. Um, I'm going to set it right there. I'm going to glue her down like that. This is also a beautiful brooch from Bella Vista Marketplace. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, and I am just going to try and pin it in so that whoever would like to purchase this project, which will be on sale in my eat sister. And I'll be open up uh I'll will be opening up a Wix store myself too and putting it on my website because I'm getting away from Etsy. Their um prices, their fees are outrageous. Okay, so there we go. So whomever gets this, they can unpin this and put it on something else if they want. Look how gorgeous that does. The silver pops from the silver of this. I love Shabby Chic. You just can't get away from it. I don't care how much mixed media I do. The Shabby Chic. Okay, sorry about that. I had to come back. Okay, so I am just going to put hot glue. I like using hot glue because um, this is fabric going onto a wood. So I'm not. And I like to press it down. And as I'm pressing, I will fix this real pretty bow. Isn't that gorgeous? Gorgeous. Isn't it beautiful? This is so shabby chic. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Now on the to hang it. Um well there's several options here. Like last year I got these real pretty um pearl uh garland, real pretty chunky pearl garland for uh, in the Christmas section. I got it in cream and in white. Um, I don't know. Ouch. You know, like, I don't know. Probably gonna be too chunky if you ask me. Then you can do the shabby way. You can um, you can do a loop like this. What do I want to do? Sometimes it's um. Hmm. Or you can do just regular. Like a regular, just a simple, I think it's what I'll do. It's just a simple little, um, simple little beaded piece here. Let's see. Some less is more. Because all of the attention is down here on this bow. And let's see. And I did not color the back because I like to felt my backs or I just leave them. Um, in this case, this wood is so smooth. Um, it would be absolutely fine to um, leave it. And I'm just going to glue those down like that. Um, but the choice is yours. 
Now, if you want to do like um, a double-sided tag where one side says something and then you flip it, um, the other side says something, then that's when you would pay, a, you know, I would pay attention um, to the detail of it. And I'm going to sign this piece. I always like to sign my work. I'm about to embark on getting my mantle made for Halloween. So I'm debating on um, I'm debating on um, recording me doing that. So here you go. This would look so cute on a boudoir. A bathroom door to a ladies room um, this is so so cute I just love it and I'm gonna um, I think I might glue just a little bit here nothing too drastic and what I might do is use a piece of Bella Vista bling. Let me go get a piece of Bella Vista bling. Yes, Bella Vista has all sorts of bling uh, pieces that you can use. And beautiful, just beautiful yummies. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> I am so choked up today. <clears throat> with allergies it was so nice to spend that time in um, Arizona um, definitely a dry much drier climate I don't know will that look okay will that look okay I don't know. I might just leave it like that. But here's some beautiful pieces of bling from Bella Vista Marketplace. Gorgeous product. Gorgeous. And if you know, these are the uh, Prima Molds, the Prima Rub-On. All of these trends, um, except the, the cotton fabric that is very basic. You can get it by the yard. Um, and Joanne's Redder, uh, is, this is from my personal stash, but beautiful lace trims and that you can use. Um, what I like about this particular trim here is it comes, uh, you get it in a two-piece section like this, and it's already cut, so um, you can cut it. And then, uh, like I said, just regular pearl strands. And there you go. This tag is so amazing. I have another one, and I'm going to do a Christmas one. And then they have the beautiful uh, wood frames in the store. And all of that will be linked in the description box down below. So I love how this vintage it come out vintage -y. It's just beautiful. Perfect, again, for a ladies room, uh, a boudoir. Just something, you know, just something. I just love it. So, there we go. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Um, if you have any questions, please direct them to Bella Vista Marketplace. Um, you can contact them on um, Facebook or through their email. And, uh, of course, through their website at bellavistamarketplace.com. If you have any questions for me, uh, please let me know, and um, I will be more than happy to answer them for you. Again, thank you so much for watching this tutorial, and I look forward to making many more. Bye! Bye.